Dear students, today we will learn another exciting thing in Dreamweaver that is how to add uh, bullet points, numbering or what we call in Dreamweaver as list. So there are two types of lists available, unordered list, it's just like uh, bullets and ordered list that's like numbering or some uh, which has some order A, B, C or some other thing. So let's see in the practical that how we can add such list in the HTML document. So here is the same uh, document on which we were working and I have cleaned this document to just make it that we whatever we add to this document should be new one for this module. And now I am interested uh, to add like ITC in this and I want to make this ITC as a list, unordered list or maybe using ordered list. So let's say we try to use as the unordered list for this one. So whenever I will click on it, you will see that what will happen in the code. So I am selected this one and I have clicked this one. So it has uh, put a tag UL, unordered list and UL finishes over here. And then uh, the list item one and that is this. So this means that whatever you want to add, uh, you can uh, add using list item one. So for example, if I want to copy this code and again add some other thing, for example, English. So this will be on the same level you are saying. And then of course, we can add whatever we have learned uh, in between as well for example it can be heading one it can be bold whatever we want for example we can also say that uh, we need uh, the bold kind of thing as well so it has added in list item as bold uh, then we should also try to do it as bold as well because to make it on the same level right and then if I am interested uh, to uh, basically uh, make this thing the English as ident within ITC. So I can click on it and you can see that it has created a table of content type of thing where English has been indented and has been made a subheading with the ITC. And this can be uh, converted into the order list as well by clicking on this. So now we have unordered list and then order list. So you can see that one list item ITC has an order list and the list item is English. So we can create whatever we want uh, to show in our document. So we have learned that we can add title uh, on the page. We can add uh, some table. And we can also add some image over here, for example, if you want. So if I go over here and I say, okay, insert image. So let's see, I say, okay, we can want to add this image and this image need to be, uh, need to have some uh, name, image one. So this image has been created and let's go into the live mode. So in live mode, you can see that this is being shown like this and of course you can uh, make the size of this image a little bit smaller if you want so at the moment it is 1280 uh, width and 960 height so we can say we want 400 by 300 image so it will be shifted like this and you can uh, save all and this is not my first page now. I guess it's my fourth page. So let's add such kind of information and save it. And then if you go into this and this is my fourth page. So you can see that ITC is on the uh, is as unordered list and then English as an order list. but as an identity and indented 
and then there is an image in between so dear students let's conclude today's module we have learned that how we can add uh, numbering and bullets uh, as order list and unordered list in the uh, in our uh, html or web page using dreamweaver so it was very easy that we just clicked on the things and the code was generated by itself and we have also added some image uh, as well in the web page and we have seen that it was really impressing that when we saved and really view that uh, whole web page and it was attractive enough that we have learned um, how we can add different things to our web page so in the next module we will try to make a realistic uh, web page in which um, there are uh, there is a usage of all of the things which we have learned until now